Ah, it is going to be a long day of metal detecting. It's going to be a long weekend, actually. It's Friday. We're going to detect all day, hit the beaches. Saturday. Whew. We're going tubing. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to metal detect while we're tubing down the river, but I am going to see what the eye track can find. I'm going to bring the snorkel, goggles. We're just going to go around looking for stuff that's been dropped in the water from all the drunk tubers. Uh, so that's going to be fun. And Sunday, we're back at the beach. So let's go find some treasure. looks like. All right, we're on the board. Platinum. Things were looking rough today. The weather's a little bleak. Uh, we haven't been digging a whole lot, but we just scored a nice little dolphin ring. This is the second dolphin ring I found this year. And this one's silver, 925. We're gonna keep hitting it. Uh, just walked into a little area. <laughs> oh, just walked into a little area where we're starting to get some targets, so let's see what else we can pull out of here. Check this out. <laughs> so, we're out here just metal detecting, and I see this little baggie floating. And what do you guys think's inside? <laughs> Hopefully that's real. That would be an awesome, awesome little ticket right there. Uh, looks like it's a little wet, but uh, I think we can dry this out. Ah oh, man, that would have been awesome if there's more than one in there. But we'll take it. Ah, I love it. All right, check out this. So it's been another five minutes since I found that $20 bill. And now this guy just floated by. Insulated. Puller bottle. I'm gonna hang on to this. This might be worth a pretty penny. Boulder, Colorado. Thanks, Colorado. I appreciate it. So just as we are about ready to pack up for lunch today, I uh, had a car pull up next to me here, and a gentleman rolled down his window and asked me, hey, is that a metal detector? Yeah, it is. <laughs> anyway, he uh, said he lost his wedding band right out there in the dunes there. He's standing out there where he thinks it was. The thing of it is, it was a year and a half ago, so it could still be there because I don't think many people hunt that grassy area, but I do know that that area does get detected quite a bit along the beach line and in the water. So we're going to grab a little lesh, a pinpointer. Let's see if we can find it. He said it's tungsten. I didn't find his ring. We're going tubing.